Let me tell you, I watched three videos on YouTube today, and the intro was like that on all three of them. Is this how I have to talk to you guys to become YouTube famous? It took me like three tries to do that. Damn, y'all think I'm loud in videos? <laughs> but anyways, today we are doing texts that should have never been sent. Hey, you around? Yeah, I'm in town. Will you walk to fifth with me? I want to ask you something. Yeah, sure. I'll be there in five. Dude, she's on her way. What do I say to her? Jesus, she's so hot. I can't do it. Thanks, I guess. <laughs> he meant to send that to his friend. But sent it to his crush. I mean, at least she sent a winky face back. Like, what's the worst that can happen? I mean, I hope she likes him back. I mean, this would be so weird if your friend sent you that, like, freaking out about how hot you are. Sorry, we can't be friends anymore. <laughs> or maybe the opposite happened. Maybe they started dating after this. We don't know. This girl texted her mom. We should go to IHOP today. It's free pancake day. Who this? Besides, I'm happily married with five kids and I don't think my husband would like it if I went out to eat with you. Besides that, I wouldn't waste my time with you since you want to take me out only because it's free. Mom is Gracie. <laughs> Damn, Mom, go off. You don't even got your own daughter's number added on your phone. She just wanted to get you some free pancakes and you out here being rude. Brian, your next automated pizza delivery is scheduled for Saturday, February 25th. To confirm, text yes. To decline, text no. Text help for help. Thank you, Papa John, you handsome man. I shall call you the carbs vixen. We're sorry, we didn't understand. Please confirm or decline. When I make love, I imagine you tossing some dough shirtless. Dude, our automated system isn't set up yet. This is a real person texting you. I make minimum wage. Please just tell me if you want the pizza. <laughs> is this legit? This poor guy gotta manually text everybody when their pizza is gonna be delivered. I make minimum wage. I wish I could find a guy just like you. You know who is a guy just like me? Who? Me. Ha, <laughs> you're so funny. That's why we are best friends. <laughs> <laughs> That's the saddest story I ever heard. Girls, hi! This is rude. Don't do this. Is this Kristen? No, this is Jake from State Farm. So, it is? Let me put it to you in simpler terms, friend. You have the wrong number. My bad. <laughs> you heard the man's. Jake from State Farm. Where you at? Sam's. Take a photo. What is Sam smoking? <laughs> A Capri Sun. His mother was like, what are you boys up to? What is Sam smoking? Is that what the kids are smoking these days? Is that the marijuana, the devil's lettuce? Mother, it's a Capri Sun. Let Sam sip his drink. The mom is like, are you guys eating? Yes, mom. I'm hungry. Can you get me something? There's food at the house. Wow, really? Oh, how the tables have turned. You always ask mom for food. And she's like, there's food in the house. There's food in the fridge. There's food in the pantry. And when she asks, you just play the old switcheroony. So this girl sent a pic of her hand with her two fingers taped together. Oh my god, what happened? I put tape on my fingers. <laughs> Oh my god, I swear, this should be a challenge that you send to your moms. If I said this to my mom, she would freak out. Like, oh my god, what did you do to your hand? What happened? Are you okay? Call 911! Hello, can we get an ambulance now? It's just tape. So, how was the date last night, bro? Did you score? Not quite. First date, we went to dinner and then I walked her home. Then I killed her in the woods outside her house and left. Kissed! I kissed her in the woods! Outside her house and left. Not killed. You didn't see anything. Yikes. If you ever get mad at him, send that to the police for proof. Tell me how you met him. Well, we met at a party in December. We were a bit tipsy and he kissed me under some camel toe. <laughs> well, I guess you would need to be tipsy to kiss under a camel toe. Mistletoe. Mistletoe. We kissed under the freaking mistletoe. Imagine kissing under a camel toe. <laughs> was watching food videos and my mom thought I was texting a guy. Wow. <laughs> her mom texted her, why are you smiling at your phone? While she watches somebody mixing up some peanut butter. Like she probably looking at her phone like, mmm, that look good. I've never seen anything so beautiful. This is my mom. Every time I used to like watch a funny video, looking at my phone and start laughing, she'd be like, who are you talking to? What's he saying to make my daughter laugh? Hmm? Hmm? When you look at a ceiling, it looks like there's no way you could fit a bed and other furniture on it. But you can, because it's just the floor, but high. 
Bruh. You know what? He ain't wrong. When you look at the ceiling, it looks smaller. Like, you think of, like, how could everything in this room fit up there? Look at your ceiling right now and tell me it doesn't look smaller. One like on this video equals one ceiling that fits. Fits what? What? How to give scammers a mini heart attack. Congratulations, ma'am, sir. Your mobile phone number had won a laptop from Consuelo Company. To claim your price, please text your complete name, address, age, work. I'm sec, Gustino at Titus. Thank you. And then she gonna play the switcheroni and make him win something. Congratulations, you have successfully subscribed to prayer of the day. 50 pesos will be deducted from your load. I have set the Lord always before me. He is at my right hand. I will not be shaken. And the scammer panics. Cancel. Sorry, you have entered an invalid code. Please try again. Cancel. Sorry, you have entered an invalid code. Please try again. <laughs> get my 50 pesos back you don't know what to do you know what this is this is good I like this anybody that texts you a congratulations you won no congratulations you have been to subscribe to booty pics daily for only $14.99 we will send you a free booty pic every single day for the rest of your life no cancellation bye yo who is this it's Pedro we met at the club last night uh you have the wrong number she gave me Number. I'm sorry, Pedro. You don't have to yell at me. I'm the victim here. You was texting me. Poor Pedro. One like equals one real phone number for Pedro. I wonder, instead of giving somebody a fake number, what if you give them your number and then when they text you and you don't want to talk to them, just be like, wrong number. <laughs> it's great. I really tried and died for this cause. So this dude was like, hey, Gushers, please DM me. It's important. Gushers is like, Please send us a DM using the link below. Thank you. And then this dude sent them. Okay, so what if, hear me out, there was a fruit snack that looked like a laundry pod, not any specifically branded one because you know, legality. But what if it looked like a laundry pod? We all wanna eat them so bad. Thanks for your time, I hope it takes off. Wink. Two minutes later. You can send direct messages to this person. Gushers blocked them. <laughs> we know what you're getting at. That's showbiz, baby. How did Emily break her finger? Her finger got stuck in my butthole. What? Holy sh- My buckle. Belt buckle. <laughs> buckle. How's she gonna break her finger in a belt buckle? Why was it in there in the first place? Not really too far from the first one, eh? You know what? This is fine. Everybody gets their fingers stuck in buckles. Mom, is damn a bad word? Um, yes. Damn, okay. Didn't I just say it was? <laughs> His mom is totally a teacher. She got that teacher look going on. She gonna give you that look even through text. Like, the fuck you just say? It's a bad word. You hear the one about the airplane? No. Hey, it probably go over your head. I'm pretty smart. Try me. <laughs> gotcha. Oh. Too perfect. Too perfect. Somebody actually fell for this one. What are you, like five? Hello, you little <laughs> And why would you ignore my message? Hi, Eve. It's been a long time since you last messaged me asking for a driving lesson. And so I assumed you no longer needed, wanted them. I assure you I've not ignored any messages. I'd have been happy to start up your driving lessons again. However, not after being called Head. Dave, this girl mistaked her ex-boyfriend Dave for her driving instructor, also named Dave. Sorry, Dave. <laughs> that sucks. Poor dude, like, hella confused, like, you want driving lessons or not? I thought you didn't need them anymore. Why is this girl being so rude to me? What are you doing? Homework. Oh my gosh, I fit in me to send that, mom. This is what y'all doing? When you say you doing. Homework? How to get grounded 101. Hi, I found this phone. You're the first on the contact list. Could you tell your friend it's been found? Which friend? The one whose name is at the top of your screen. Haha, <laughs> oh yeah, <laughs> lol. So, can you tell them I found it? Yeah, will do. Hi, it's Adam. Someone's found your phone. <laughs> This is the world we live in, guys. The world we live in. I feel like my friend lost his phone. So I'm gonna text his phone that he lost his phone. Hey. Hello. What color panties you got on? White ones with doo-doo stains on them. <laughs> Why 
is this me? I'm court tomorrow. Can I come? For what, weirdo? To see you go to jail! <laughs> You. Maybe I wanted you to leave. You know what? My ex should have kept me blocked. <laughs> My cousin sent me $130 through Cash App by accident and wants me to send it back. Destiny, I accidentally Cash Apped you $130. I was trying to send it to somebody else for this outfit. Can you please send it back? Nah, you sent it to me. It's my money now. Bye, b but anyways, that's all for today. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to hit that like button and that. And comment below how much money you have in your bank account or how much V-Bucks you got in your Epic account. And make sure you subscribe to the Wolf Pack. Oh, I love you guys so much. Thanks for watching. Bye, guys.